in the studios at WTTW, and this is where the sneak preview show started 35 years ago. In fact, I'm sitting in one of the original chairs where Roger sat and where Jean Siskel sat. Former litigation attorney Chaz Ebert adds a new role to her already impressive repertoire, television producer. As the executive producer of Ebert Presents at the Movies, Chaz is revamping the classic PBS program for today's audience. Might not be big enough. I made the transition from actively practicing law about 20 years ago when I became the vice president of the Ebert Company. The biggest transition has only been within the last year when Roger and I decided to produce this movie review show that he started 35 years ago. They invented the genre of a movie review show, and when Roger asked me to be the producer of the show, I had to think about how to make it fresh and interesting for, for today's audience, and I think we've done a very good job of doing that. One of the decisions I made, I didn't want two white males in the chair. I wanted to have a woman critic so I can have some viewpoints from a woman's point of view. One of our hosts is Christy Lemire of the Associated Press. And I also wanted to have someone who brought a, perhaps a different perspective to it. Our co-host is Ignati Vizhnevetsky. I just like his sensibility about the movie. One of the other things I'm very proud of is talking my husband into going before the camera. After his illness, he thought that his broadcasting days were over, but I like what he brings to the show, and I felt that it was important to show people with differing abilities on television. The ever-busy Ms. Ebert shares her husband's passion for film. Chaz not only oversees production of Ebert Presents, but she is very involved as the producer of the ever-popular Ebert Fest Film Festival. We celebrated the 13th year of Ebert Fest this year. I love Ebert Fest. There are some films that have been picked up for either theatrical distribution or for cable after being at our festival. You never know who's, who's there, you never know who sees your film, you never know who wants to help you. Through the Ebert Company, Chaz and Roger Ebert continue to support the artistic dreams of filmmakers. And with all her many commitments, one wonders, what is her favorite film? Clockwork Orange. It's a film my husband gave thumbs down to, but it's still one of my favorite films of all times. 